Pandora has no hope. You have no reason to trust me, I get that. But if you're going to stop Jack from controlling the warrior, <clears throat> you'll need my help. Because I know where the key is. It's with me. Welcome to my humble shop. May it keep you safe in your travels. Pleasure doing business. I'm sure we'll be doing this again soon enough. You're an organ donor. Find a way back here as quick as you can. Now that Sanctuary's reappeared, you can use any fast travel station to get back to the Crimson Raiders. I'll mark the nearest one on your Echo device. Stealth! Error. Location, Sanctuary. Not found. Oh no. The phase blast must have taken Sanctuary off the fast travel network. Um... Okay. Head to the Iridium Extraction Plant now. I think I know how to get you back to your friends. You know, I didn't lie to you about everything. You really are the only person who can stop Jack. Roland, Lilith, and Mordecai. He defeated them long ago. They can help you reach him, but in the end, it will be you who brings Jack down. Thank you. 
Success imminent. Prepare to move.
Any bots attempting to steal Iridium crystals will be congratulated for their initiative before their public disassembly. A baby in tears. Due to previous statements elicited any emotional reaction, report to your supervisor for summary destruction. Reminder to all Hyperion robots. <sighs> Any and all supply drops lost to pressure attack. Do you see those lunar supply shots? We need to steal a lunar supply beacon and get the moon base to send you an uncalibrated fast travel unit. You can use that to get Sanctuary back on the fast travel network. Simple. Except not at all. Just eat the beacon? 
you'll need to get that back. You are adequate. Calibrated fast travel unit from the moon base. You'll need a quiet place to set up the beacon. Head to the town of Overlook. Thanks to Hyperion's mining operations, the people of Overlook suffer from the skull shivers. They won't disturb us. so frustrating. You see, this is what I don't get about you bad guys. You know the hero's gonna win, but you just don't die quickly. Man, uh, example, this one guy in New Haven, right? City's burning, people <laughs> <laughs> left and right, yada yada yada. This jackal rushes me with a spoon. <laughs> a freaking spoon, and I'm dying laughing, right? So I scoop out his stupid little eyeballs with it, and his kids are all weh! And I... <laughs> oh, <laughs> he can't see where he's going, he's bumping into stuff, and I... <laughs> anyway, I don't know, maybe he had to be there. The moral is, you're a total bitch. Nice little town until Hyperion took over. 
Now everybody there has got the skull shivers thanks to Jack's mining operations. Poor bastards are too sick to leave their homes. You'll want to set up the beacon over there. Once the moon base processes our request, you should have a fast travel station. <gasps> it's transmitting the supply request now. We've just got to wait a few minutes and... Angel, that's enough. You can stop pretending to help the bad guys now. Angel? We don't have long until Jack realizes I'm not helping you anymore. Defend that beacon. Now, if you can't even handle these loaders, you're really gonna disappoint me. Calibrated fast travel station request received. Estimated processing time, three to six weeks. No, 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 no. I'll, I'll move some data around, see if I can bump you up in the queue. Angel, what the hell are you doing? Success. I've increased your request's priority. Tebow Junction can live with our medical supplies for a few months. Lethal 
Force authorized. Engineers denied our request. I'll see what I can do. Send in the constructors. I want those bastards dead now! your fast travel station very soon. God damn it, Angel! What are you doing? Those are the bad guys! I'm sending everything I have at you! Everything!
Major Lottery is almost upon us. Mandatory tickets will... Just protect the beacon for another few seconds. The fast travel has landed. Welcome Give me a second while I calibrate it to Sanctuary's new position. Fast travel station calibrated. Location, Sanctuary, is now available for travel. Go! You can buy from me! A fantastic day for capitalism! Tell your friends where you got that! Hey! May it serve you well! Good luck! Lock and load! The city may be safe right now, but what happens if Hyperion launched? Oh good, you're not dead. That's his way of saying, wow, you're a badass, I'm glad you're okay. Right, sorry. We'd all be dead if it weren't for you. Jack's getting closer and closer to digging up the warrior, and we still don't know where he's got the vault key stashed. I can help you with that. You? Damn it, we told you never to contact us again! Will you please just hear me out? Sure, let's listen to the crazy computer that just tried to kill us. Hey, remember that time she told us the vault was full of loot? It's with me. I'm charging the vault key. Continue. The key naturally charges itself once every 200 years. Jack is patient, but he's not that patient. He's been using my power to forcibly charge the key with Iridium. If you find me, you find the Vault Key. The Vault Key is housed in my AI control core atop Thousand Cuts. It's protected by three impassable security hurdles. The 
the first is a competitor deterrence field that will obliterate any non-Hyperion entity passing through it. Competitor deterrence field? What, like a death wall? It is a field of pure thermosonic energy programmed to atomize any unauthorized personnel. So yeah, a death wall. Beyond that lies the second hurdle, a defense bunker outfitted with the most high-tech weaponry Hyperion can afford. That doesn't sound good. Past the bunker, you'll have to get through the final hurdle, a door that will only open for Handsome Jack. Well, that sounds even worse. This will be your only opportunity to steal the vault key and stop Jack from controlling the warrior. I'm out of time. Do what you will, but promise me this. No matter what happens, do not allow Lilith into my chambers. What the hell's that supposed to mean? If she was luring us into a trap, she would have made it sound a little bit possible. If we're taking that bitch down, I'm coming. Trap or not. If anyone's gonna shut it down, it has to be you, soldier. Head to the house. I think I know how to get past the first hurdle.
Your friend Claptrap could get through that Hyperion force field. Now he's out of date though, he'll need a what software upgrade. Murder? Mordecai should have what you need. need. <laughs> he's camped out near the preserve. I think he needs your help with something. about Sanctuary. You all right? Sorry I missed the action. I saw some Hyperion movement out of Thunder Express. So Bloodwing and I checked it out. Didn't realize we were walking in. Rolling Echo to head. All my data's on a chip in my third Bloodwing's car, including your flat trap upgrade. Saw my Hyperion jackasses nab her and took her into the preserve over there. I'm glad you're here. I've been scouting the place for the last half hour. Looks like at least a two men. You can get inside to the shipyard. I can give you support and lead you to blow. Me. You get my bird, you get your clap trap upgrade. I'll provide support, just like a Tony Express. Check this. 
laugh. He kidnapped Blood Wings, so I start piercing my pants, making threats that if anything happens to my bird, I'll blah, blah, blah. But Blood and I have been through a lot. I know my girl can handle herself. Blood 
Jake should be in the holding cells at the other end of the facility. You find her, you'll find your flap trap upgrade. <clears throat> Another notch on my rifle. 